Ted Dexter was a terrific cricketer. Ted Dexter was an incredibly stylish, uh, cavalier kind of batsman. He was known as Lord Ted, um, partly because he had a sort of slightly lordly bearing, but also because of his, the way he imposed himself at the crease. I played against him in 1962-3 when he was captain of England. I was playing for South Australia and I caught him in both innings of that game. Uh, the first one at second slip and the second one I was at point. And it's one of the hardest hit cricket balls I've ever fielded. In fact, as I caught it right in front of my face, it, I looked at my hand and there was a big blue mark on my hand. It would have killed me if I hadn't caught it. Ted had to walk right past me and typical of uh, Ted's very droll sense of humour, he looked at me and he said, son, you've got a nasty habit of getting in the way. He scored plenty of test hundreds, including a double century in Karachi, but I think the innings that often get spoken about most with him was uh, an innings of 70 of 75 balls against West Indies at Lords in 63, when he took the attack to a very fine West Indian uh, bowling unit. I think he got about 70 odd on that occasion, but I was forever a Dexter fan after that. Ted Dexter, uh, together with a couple of statisticians, Gordon Vince and Rob Easterway, came up with a, a rating system for test cricket in, in the late 80s. Uh, and in 2003, the ICC adopted that system. It's a system we still know and love today and, and, and still makes headlines. And Dexter himself called it perhaps my biggest contribution to cricket. He was a lovely player, scored hundreds all around the world, Johannesburg, Christchurch, Campoor, Bridgetown, uh, and one of the most stylish batsmen of any era. Ted made some terrific contributions, but it was as a right-hand batsman, a very technically good right-hand batsman, hard-hitting, that's where he left his big mark with me.